warning, this video contains graphic images that may not be suitable for little sissy bitches. So, your discretion is advised. We kill shit here. What's up guys? I want to show you something I just got in the mail. Uh, I, I got one auger. You guys have seen me use it over and over again, but it's kind of thin. It was basically a bulb planter from Menards. So I'm like, someday I'm going to break it, which I have broken before where the spark, the spiral stays in the ground and then all you get is the part that goes in the drill. So called Funky, a Funky Trap Tag. He's got about everything you'd ever need. I said, hey, you got a... Uh, you got a three inch auger? He said, yeah. I said, sweet, I'm gonna order one. So check this out. I had no idea what it was gonna look like, but this thing uh, is a beast. We're gonna find out. I mean, we're about to have frozen ground. So I wanna punch in as many dirt holes as I can uh, this weekend, whether I plan on setting a trap there right away or not. Just gonna drive up my trails, punch in some holes, try to get as many traps out as I can before everything is rock solid but look at this bad boy homemade he he has them made somewhere i'm not sure where but we got a sweet point on there sharpened edge i don't know just wanted to show you guys it's uh something else so uh you guys will see me using it and the guineas are freaking out and flying around like, because I just turned on the lights. <laughs> in case you're wondering what's going on, you're going to hear a lot of that, or I have to explain what's the sound in the background. So, pretty sweet. You just put your drill on there. In case you're wondering what this is, I'm testing some new bottles that I got. I want to make sure this is a literally whiskey in here. I'm literally testing seals. That's, <laughs> that's what we do now, apparently. I want to make sure that it's going to be the best it can be before I send it out. So we're testing seals. And that if, if whiskey don't eat the seals, ain't nothing going to eat the seals, right? All right. So I just wanted to show you that. This is, a, this is just going to be an oddball video in the dark, guys. Um, we're still down there at the Badgerland, so... See what happens. Stay tuned. If you're like me, you might want to test your shit out right away when you get it. Well, it's dark, but... Oh, God. I was wondering if this drill could handle it, to be honest. <laughs> oh, look at that dirt hole. Oh, yeah. We're going to make some uh, big, nasty dirt holes now, boy. Look at that. Sheesh! Big Mac Daddy dirt holes coming up. Get you some. Well, the ground ain't froze. That's a plus. Like I said, we're about to get ice fishing time, boys. So, well, I'm not sponsored by Funky, but Funky's my friend, and he he hooks me up with. Uh, with some stuff for my my uh, base and lures business, so we're gonna give them a, a plug. And plus, this is badass. I mean, this thing is—I don't know—if you're one of them guys that has to carry a long ways, it might not be for you. But we're out here in the dark. The drill battery is about toast, but it is toast. The drill battery is toast. Probably should have charged it up, but I almost wanted to see how it worked. Pretty awesome. All right, back. Let's get to the video. I got me a big old some bitch coming up right here. Stay tuned. What's up, guys? Look at this badger we got. This is a. I don't know if it's the angle he's at or what, but it looks like a giant freaking badger. Sheesh. Uh, got the biggest mound you could ever see. Look at this mound. That's going to be a lot of freaking... Oh, that's a doozy. Oh, yeah. You don't like that? That 
is a big badger. Sheesh. That's a doozy, boys. Oh, man. Farmer's going to be happy. Look at the freaking Jesus. We'll get him out and get a better look at him. But That's why we use wolf fangs. He dug all the way down. He could have been right on the wolf fangs. Sorry, it's windy. Oh, God, I'm just filming with the filming with the phone here. He's pissed. That is a big son of a bitch, guys. Stay tuned. We'll get him out of the trap. Duke 650 holding strong. Uh, back foot cats, obviously. I'll get him out of here. We're going to see what he looks like. And we'll take him back to the shed. Stay tuned. Guineas are getting bigger and running around enjoying the warmth of the wood stove. I just thought I'd show you just now because they were flopping around. But got her zeroed out. He's fairly heavy for... For a badger. Oh god. Oh god. Hit the hole, hit the hole. <laughs> oh shit, this one handed stuff's for the birds. Alright, what do we got here? That's a pretty good sized badger. <laughs> 20 pounds. This is as much as my bobcats have been weighing. It's a. got some cockaburrs. But I don't know how they wouldn't. Look how thick the fur is on this guy. So underrated fur. Look at the fur. Sheesh. Giant claws. Yeah, he's a good looking badger. Yeah, it is in fact a male, looks like. But I just wanted you guys to, I mean, just the size of the head. He's a pretty dang good sized badger. For only being 20 pounds, but. I guess I better say it was in a dirt hole. <laughs> dirt hole and then my basin layer is obviously in the hole. So I appreciate it guys. I did catch one raccoon there. Probably four days ago, so it was in a remake, so thanks for watching.